We need to get back into the whole routine. Absolutely pouring. Will you play? No. Play. Fine. It's my birthday. It's your birthday. <sighs> okay. Okay, update. It is 20 to 9. We've just got back from taking Lexi to school. Um, they can't go in through the main entrance because they're doing all building works for the next couple of years, basically. So she had to find the side entrance. So I walked up with her to find the side entrance because she was a bit worried about finding it. And I carried him. I didn't bother with a buggy or nothing. I carried him. So now I'm a bit worn out. And uh, Lexi wasn't very happy about going back to school. Not the, exactly the going back to school bit, but she's got a wobbly tooth, which is really, really hurting her, and she's finding it hard to even swallow. Dropped it. You go on the floor then. And uh, so, yeah, she wasn't very happy about that. It's just me and the boy. Adrian started work at 8 this morning, and he had to walk because it would have been too much to be have Lexi ready to go early. We need to get back into the whole routine. <sighs> I did just notice when Hudson had his morning bottle, there's only one more bottle ready. There is a, a couple in the dishwasher that just need filling up. So I need to get that done. Otherwise they won't be cool enough for when he wants them. And uh, so yeah, just me and the boy alone. It's been a while, isn't it? It's gonna be quiet without Lexi. Although, actually, since her room has been tidy enough to um, actually go in there, um, we haven't seen her since. So, but then Adrian's been here, so I've not been alone with Hudson. But it's just me and him, and he's doing so much more now since when Lexi was at school. He can stand up without even holding on to anything. <coughs> Feels like any minute he's just going to start walking. But, uh, yeah, I better go get those bottles sorted out. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? No, oh, snuggles with mummy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fall off the sofa. <laughs> Why are you being so cute? Are you going to be a good boy for me today? <laughs> Hudson's asleep in his cot upstairs. Hooray! And I'm going to make myself a fish finger sandwich. I've just put the fish fingers in the oven. I'm in here because I don't really want to talk while I'm in the kitchen in case the sound travel travels upstairs too much. Even though I have shut the door. I don't want to wake him up, do I? Not at all. So while I'm waiting for my fish fingers to cook, I'm going to give the kitchen a bit of a clean. Again, because housework never ends. Here he is, just waking up from his nap. He had about two hours up there without me needing to go up at all. So that's very, very good. And I almost finished cleaning the kitchen. I've got the video half edited, like it's, I've just got to do text and music now. And I had my lunch and I almost finished cleaning the kitchen. Everything's in the dishwasher, it's just the sides didn't finish getting wiped down. So yeah, if we can keep these two hour naps upstairs going, we'll be sorted, won't we? Oh, lovely sleepy snuggles. So the little boy here is just having a biscuit after having some pasta shapes and oh, when um, I took him up to bed earlier 
he was crawling about and he fell and he bonked on something and uh, he was crying really quite hard so I got him out and had a look but I couldn't see where he'd bonked himself or anything but since he's been up I don't know if you can see his eye let's see if we can get it a bit brighter look he's got a horrible red eye so he must have just caught himself on the corner of the eye there it's very red and it oh no no it's all red and a little bit swollen so I wonder if this is going to be his first ever black eye oh it's Mr Tumbles on TV he's just come up alright well let's stop filming so we can watch Mr Tumble in peace So we are literally minutes away from leaving to go and get Lexi and look at it. Absolutely pouring. Oh dear. And just like that, it stopped. It's not raining anymore. Maybe a little bit. So we better get moving. Well, I was just going to say Hudson's happy to have his sister back, but he's getting out. Get back in here. You play. No. Play. Fine. Yeah. That's exactly what I was doing. Just covering myself with the yeah. balls. Yeah. Wait, are you going? Maybe. I'll see yes soon. Oh. Boom. Ah. <laughs> So as it's Adrian's birthday, I thought I'd cook him one of his favourite dinners, which is sausages and mash with baked beans. And when he was a kid, he used to have it like this. Like a Millennium Dome, with the sausages sticking out the mash and the beans on top. So that's what I've done. But he's not here. He was going to try his bike on the way home from work, to come home from work, and it's not working. So he's going to call his mum to see if she could pick him up and I don't know what's happened from that. I need to be going out to pick up a PE kit for Lexi because we can't find hers and she's got PE tomorrow. And so his is going to have to go in the microwave because I've got to eat mine and uh, go out as soon as he gets in really. So if he is walking it's going to be about half an hour till he's in yet. And here he is just two minutes after I filmed that. It's my birthday. It's your birthday! What's the time now? Half seven. I left at seven in the morning. Oh, baby. Twelve and a half hours I've been at this house on my birthday. Well, come and have dinner. Yes. Come and have dinner. Yes. Yeah. Food. I had no breakfast, no lunch. No. It's in the microwave. It hasn't long gone into the microwave, though. I have just finished dishing that. Oh, it's not working. My birthday. It's your birthday. <laughs> hey look, it's the O2. I call it Millennium Dime. Me too. I <laughs> thought I'd call it the O2 because of her. Yum yum yum. I made loads of mash. <laughs> and sing on it. I didn't listen. Well, I did. I just didn't think it meant 
Ja, det 